in this post, I'm just going to go over a few things that you can do to embellish your post, to dress it up a little bit. For example, the title here, uh, or any text, you can make it whatever color you'd like for it to be. So, for example, let's take the title here, and we want to make it a uh, color. You go over here to text color, and you have the drop-down menu. Let's say we want to make this text mm, a purple color. We add that to it. Uh, what else could you do to your text? Let's say, for example, that part of this text right here is a quote. You can block that out. This whole section here, you'll see how it will be aligned once we go to the page, but you can already see there. Let's update it and let's just look at those two changes. And then we'll go and view the post. Meditation for Beginners. And we see that the color has changed here. And we see that this text over here has been uh, uh, moved slightly to the right. Uh, that gives it a slightly different effect. Let's say we want to do that for this text down here as well. So we'll go back and edit this aspect of the page and what you can do at some point um, let's just let's put this cursor not there let's put the cursor over here and let's just see what happens when we do that okay it will move that over and make that whole section a block a block area now let's say you don't want to have that all you have to do you have the undo button and the redo button here you just click on undo and it will take that away now this particular text right here is too close to the picture so I want to move it over in fact I'm going to move it down below the picture to or the image to make it more easier easier to read one of the things that you want to do, remember in adding a, a, a post, you don't want posts where there's just a whole lot of reading, a whole bunch of paragraphs. This is why you break it up with that block quote, adding images, adding color, adding subtitles, and so forth. Those things help to make it easier for your visitors to read. And so with that... Um, there's one other piece that I'm going to talk about that doesn't have specifically to do with posts, but before I do that, let me go back over. Let's save this. Let's update this. And I want to go back over to the all posts page and show you where this post is. So we're back here. We want to go to all posts. And we'll see that here is this post, Meditation for Beginners by Kamal Kenyatta, the category of meditation, the, the tags of geese, how to meditate, limitless love, and the date uh, of time that it was published. Now, the SEO stuff is some, th some material that I'll have to go over with you probably a few weeks or months down the road once you have some things up there that will help get your post better ranked on the search engines. Anyway, now if you want to go back, if you want to get rid of a post, you click, you simply click trash and it throws it away. If you want to edit a post, you can go here. Quick edit is something that you, you can or cannot use. You can go in and change the title of the post, for example, and the, the slug, it will change it. Uh, you can change the date of the publication if you want. You can add the categories in here. This is almost like a quick way to uh, make some uh, changes. You can also have a password. If you have a 
a post that you only want a select number of people to see, you can create a password and give that password to those people only, and they will be the only ones that will be able to see that particular post. It's rare that that's going to happen, but it just shows you some of the things that are available um, to you. With that, that ends how to add posts uh, to your blog. It's more than enough to get going. If you have any questions, of course, you can call me on this. And then there's one more video I'm going to, to go over um, with you. This ends the the, the uh, videos for posts. Love.